Bago ka lang ba sa Bath and Body Works, tapos hindi mo alam sa dami ng mga scents, hindi mo alam kung saan ka mag -umpisa. Well, this video was made for you. So keep on watching. Alright, so meron tayong 15, I think. Hindi ko na alam. I, I tried to whittle it down to 10, pero 15 yata yung nasa harap ko ngayon. <laughs> and uh, dito ka lang, dito, dito, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Oh my God, natagal na akong din nag-record. Nabubulo na yung lola nyo. I've been busy. So, anyway, di, ito lang naman yung mga suggestion ko for each specific na type. Hindi naman ibig sabihin ay kolektahin mo na lahat ng to. Just choose kung ano yung mga natitripan mo sa mga babanggitin ko. So, let's start with this one. We have Butterfly from Bath and Body Works. Lahat to Bath and Body Works. Why do I keep saying that? Ang ganda ng packaging niya. Like, look at that. Um, it's a purple butterfly. Um, tapos... Andyan yung notes niya. This is raspberry nectar, iris petals, and airy vanilla. So, this is a fruity, sweet, floral type of scent na may vanilla base. But, hindi siya yung tipong vanilla na gourmand vanilla. It's just a, a hint. <laughs> hindi siya yung tipong vanilla like in your face vanilla. It's just like in the base. Pero, if you like sweet pea ni Bath and Body Works, yung mga sweet pea na scents, it's a little bit close to that. Yun yung parang closest na mai kukumparahan ko dito kay Butterfly. Maganda tong pabango na to. I think Chan liked this on me. Um, sabi niya, pag lumabas yung perfume, bilin mo. But I did not because I have the lotion and I have this. And I think that's okay. I don't love it that much. Pero kung ikaw yung tipong gusto mo ng mga fruity na floral type of scents, um, perfecto. So, this is for all year round. This is a versatile scent as well. Na pwede siya sa pambata. Although, not yung as in a very young, pero parang nakikita ko siya can be used by a teenager, but can also be used by a grown-up woman. Pwede rin siya sa initan. Pwede rin sa semi-formal event. Um, pag super form formal, siguro not really, but it's a very versatile scent all year round. So, kung ikaw yung tipong isa lang yung bibilhin mo, this can be a contender. <laughs> contender. Bat butterfly. <laughs> butterfly. Butterfly of <laughs> Bath and Body Works. Nabubulal pa rin ako. <laughs> Tagal na ako din na nag-record, so please bear with me. So, pagpapalit-palitin natin yung matamis and a little bit floral, a little bit fresh. So, we have Beach Nights. So, para kanino yung Beach Nights? Beach Nights ay para sa mga naghahanap ng marshmallow scents. Because this one is Toasted Marshmallow, Sea Salt Breeze, S'mores Accord, Beach Driftwood, and Creamy Vanilla. Ooh, so, yeah. <laughs> Ito yung mga toasted na marshmallow na scent. Minsan kasi, pag may mga notes na marshmallow ay yung mga pabango, hindi mo siya masyadong naamoy na matamis na marshmallow. Matamis? Matamis na marshmallow. Ito yung toasted talaga na marshmallow na matamis na may salt in here. So, meron siyang driftwood. So, I think that gives that gives it na a perfumey aspect. Pero, it's a foodie type of scent na yung iba, minsan hindi nila gusto yung pagiging salty niya. Salty s'mores. Pero, para sa akin, I like it. Beach nights. Para sa mga gusto ng toasted, the marshmallow type of fragrance. Matamis. Sugary sweet. Ang mga taste na mga mag magkakagusto nito. Maamay mo talaga. It's a salted marshmallow na toasted. Beach nights. Let's move on to a fresh one. So, this one is rose. So, this is a highly complimented na scent nung ginamit ko siya sa office. Uh, marami sa mga co-workers ko, which is around my age range, which is... 5 years younger or, or, or older than me. I'm 30 by the way. So yeah, this was highly um, highly complimented by those girls na within the range ng 25 pataas. So this is a um, grown-up type of scent. Pero hindi siya yung super mature na parang powdery na rose scent. It's actually a fresh rose type of scent. I, I know na hindi nagustuhan to ng mga younger than 25 ng mga ka-office ko. And... <laughs> Pero highly complimented siya sa mga, ano, <laughs> mga 30 plus. <laughs> yeah, this is a clean type of rose. Rose. <laughs> this is a freshy, floral type of fragrance na parang elegant pag gamit mo to. Parang linis-linis mo. Yung tipong igagalang na type of fragrance. It's also versatile. Ito, pwede siya sa formal events. Pwede mo siyang gamitin sa formal events. Tapos, pwede siya sa all year round dito sa Pilipinas. Yung mainit na panahon. I think, Kung pwede rin siya sa kung isa lang talaga yung magiging pabango mo all throughout, pwedeng pwede to kasi 
I think this can be a signature worthy type of fragrance. Let's move on to something bake shop, bakery, sweet, yung tipong parang pagkain, parang tinapay. We have Christmas cookies. So, Christmas cookies is creamy cookie dough, almond biscotti, and caramel wood. So, ito yung foodie type of fragrance. Ang hinahanap mo yung amoy makakain, amoy pagkain talaga, amoy, amoy, amoy ibe-bake na cookies. Yung tipong, it's warm na scent na ang tamis-tamis niya, pero it's warm. Uh, meron naman yung mga matatamis na very fruity na sugary sweet. Ito, it's a warm scent na para talagang nasa bake shop ka. So yeah, um, ito yung tipong kung gusto mo nung raspberry jam donut, magugustuhan mo to si Christmas cookies. It's um, a seasonal type of fragrance ni Bath and Body Works, kaya hindi siya ganun ka, ka prominent. Hindi siya masyadong maraming stock yung binibenta online from what I have noticed kasi limited edition I think or lumalabas lang siya tuwing Christmas so hindi siya ganun karami yung stocks na binibenta pero mas madali siyang hanapin kesa ras ras raspberry jam donut hindi sila exactly the same pero parang magkapamilya sila ng type of fragrance na warm, na bake shop sweet type of fragrance Christmas cookies Let's move on to something na relaxing with lavender na fragrance. Pero matamis pa rin. <laughs> so, this is Cloud 9. So, Cloud 9 is Lavender Breeze, Morning Dew Drops, and Cozy Amber. So, don't be afraid by the amber in here. It gives it that perfuminous but sweet and cozy. So, this has lavender, lavender, <laughs> lavender in here. Cloud 9 is actually a soft na pwedeng pang bedtime na scent. It's a very relaxing na scent. I have an office mate na um, <laughs> gusto gusto ko siyang budulin sana sa mga kapabang ko kasi halos lahat ng mga katrabaho ko um, they are yung mga friends ko sa work uh, nabubudol ko sila but I have this one friend na hindi ko siya talaga nabubudol pero nung naamoy niya to um, nagustuhan niya umorder, umorder siya ng decans nung nagbebenta pa ako ng decans ngayon hindi na hindi ko na maasikaso because she said it's a very relaxing na scent. So, kung ikaw yung tipong hindi ka mahilig sa mga maraming pabango, gusto mo lang ng something relaxing, um, Cloud9 might be for you. Next one, let's have something sweet again. So, actually, kung ikaw super fan ka ni Bath & Body Works, it's either you're a freshy or freshy lover, ng sensitive yung nose, or super sweet yung mga bet mo. Kasi yun yung parang signature nila na they, they do the sweet scents best. If you get what I mean. <laughs> Kasi yung mga freshies, they usually don't last that much. Kaya, mahirap. Nahirapan ako maghanap ng freshies. Ang dalawa lang yata yung na-recommend ko kanina. But, yeah. Let me know in the comment section below kung meron kang fresh na fragrance ni Bath & Body Works na long-lasting sa'yo. I would love to know. We have wrapped in vanilla. So wrapped in vanilla, um, yung mga nagre-review nito na nakikita ko online and from friends, hati sila. Some people love it and some people, eh, just eh. <laughs> but this is soft vanilla, velvet sugar, and chantilly creme. So this is, ano ba packaging niya? Like, look at that. Like, lumabas siya ata noong December. Kasi it's meant to be for winter. Yung mga malalamig na... Um, season so this is a vanilla fragrance na warm but it's not like a bakery warm type of scent but it's warm and uh, yeah matamis it's like in between vanilla bean noel and uh, strawberry pound cake I think in walang strawberry but pound cake yeah that's for my own opinion but it's closer to vanilla bean noel without the Yung naamoy ng tao doon na amoy poop. I think that's the vanilla bean. I don't know. I don't smell the amoy poop in vanilla bean Noel. The reason why hindi ko include si vanilla bean Noel sa listahan na to is because matagal na siya sa market and I'm trying to include only those na medyo bago-bago naman para hindi kayo mabore <laughs> sa mga list. Kung paulit-ulit na lang yung mga binabanggit na pabango. Ito yung mga marami pang stock and medyo bago-bagong labas. Ito, bagong labas lang to. Nilabas lang to last December, I think. And, hindi naman siya yung super bagong-bago na amoy. Ang sabi ko nga, it's close to Vanilla Bean Noel and yung dry down ni Strawberry Pound Cake, which doesn't have that strawberry, um, which is a sweet, gourmand, 
heavy, sweet, warm scent. Also, it's a, for the vanilla lovers out there. I have a few friends na vanilla lover as well, pero nakukulangan sila kay wrapped in vanilla. So, I have another suggestion if you nakukulangan ka sa vanilla nito. I'll have a few suggestions later about vanilla. Next one is a perfumey scent. We have Dream Bright. So, Dream Bright, look at that packaging. So, there are some gemstones, I think. Is, are those gemstones? I don't know. <laughs> you either like it or you hate the packaging. I don't know. I like the blue, but um, it looks like a... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I feel about this packaging. But anyway, this is Sapphire Berries Night Blooming Orchid Crystallized Vanilla. So this is a perfumey type of fragrance. If you like mga tipong dark kiss and into the night, you can mo to or starlit night. Um, it's like around that family ng um, pagka berry na raspberry na sexy na scent. So this is a little bit new. Um, it's more everyday pwede kaysa kay dark kiss and into the night. Yung dalawang yun kasi, um, they're like too heavy for a daytime type of fragrance. This is more like a party type of fragrance, date night type of fragrance. Ito para sa mga gusto ng mga sexy na fragrance but fruity and sweet. Um, sexy, ibig sabihin, um, it's more like a sensual type of fragrance, if you get what I mean. Date night talaga, pang, pang gabi. Mas maganda siya pang gabi or sa colder weather, yung perfume, pagka perfume niya. Yeah. Pero I think I, I can still use this naman during the day. Basta hindi lang yung super blazing hot outside. Uh, perhaps the office when it's air conditioned, pwede. But uh, I think it requires like a more dressed up, um, sexier type of attire para bumagay siya dito kay Dream Bright. But yeah, if if you like those type of fragrance, para sa to si Dream Bright. Kung gusto mo mga dark kiss, starlit night or into the night type of fragrance, baka magustuhan mo to. Another sweet scent that's a new addition to my collection is this one, Pumpkin Pecan Waffle. So, na hype yung pumpkin scents. I think that was um, fall last year, like fall season last year, kasi may mga nagsasabi na it promotes erection daw para sa mga guys and mm, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I haven't went out and sprayed myself and tested if my I don't know. <laughs> anyway, this is pumpkin pecan waffles. This is maple syrup, golden waffles, pumpkin spice, and brown sugar. So, I like this better than marshmallow pumpkin latte. Meron din ako nun. Meron din. Trinay ko na din yung other pumpkin scents. But, I think this is I think this is the best one among the pumpkin scents kasi it's less pumpkin, more waffle. <laughs> Pero meron pa rin yung pumpkin na, na amoy niya. Um, but it's more like a sweet maple syrup and the sugar. Para talaga siyang waffle na scent. Pero may a little bit na hint ng pumpkin na flavor. So kung gusto mong maki, maki jump sa hype ng mga pumpkin scents, I would suggest this one, this one rather than marshmallow pumpkin latte. That one, I think, is a polarizing scent na either you love it or you hate it. Kasi mas marami yatang nagpadala sa hype tapos hindi nila nagustuhan yon. I think mas marami makakagusto nito. If you like yung waffle scents na type of fragrance, yung gourmand talaga na amoy makakain ka, but less pumpkin na amoy. Like, it defeats the purpose if you're looking for a pumpkin scent. But anyway, meron pa din naman yung pumpkin niya. Or white pump white Pumpkin and chai, maganda rin yun, but I'm not suggesting should, should, I'm not suggesting that kasi mas mahal siya kaysa sa mga nakikita ko nito, si pumpkin pecan waffle. So anyway, this might be for you. Another cozy scent na naibenta ko, pero meron ako nung lotion niya, is Snowflake and Cashmere. So naibenta ko yung mist niya kasi I was decluttering and um, I'm trying to get rid of those na... I don't know, I'm, I was just trying to lessen my collection so that I can add more. <laughs> anyway, meron na kasi ako ng lotion, kaya okay lang naibenta ko yung mist. Kasi malakas na to para sa akin, itong snowflakes and cashmere. Wala na yung notes niya, but this one is a cashmere marshmallow eh. Marshmallow eh. It's a very cozy na scent. Matamis siya and it has um, yung woodiness ng pagiging cashmere. Yung wooden sa pagiging cashmere. Yung cashmere na scent kasi it, it's a little bit woody but toned down. Like sweet and 
yeah, I can just eat myself when I wear this one. <laughs> and malakas yung lotion niya kasi meron akong ka-work na binentahan ko ng lotion and mist. Tapos, pag pumapasok siya, naamoy ko siya pag ito yung gamit niya. And yeah, um, pag naglo-lotion din siya sa office, naamoy ko siya. So yeah, it's projecting kahit yung lotion lang. So okay lang ako sa lotion kaya binenta ko yung mist. Ito yung kung gusto mo ng sweet na cozy na scent na hindi yata bagay sa ma <laughs> mainit na panahon ngayon. But, if you have air-conditioned room, baka mas maganda siya pag matutulog ka, pag lotion, pag um, you just wanna be cozy when you sleep. Next one is one of my all-time favorites. We have um, whipped rose and vanilla. This is fairly new, pero one of my all-time favorites because this is a repackage of whipped rose latte. So this one is crushed rose petals, cocoa flower, and whipped foam. So, mara talaga siyang dinikdik na flower ng rose. Tapos meron siyang cream kasi matamis siya. Sabi ng isang ka office mate ko, para siyang amoy pang romansa. <laughs> meron kasi ako ng body cream nito, tapos dinala ko sa office kasi um, hindi ko siya nagagamit dito sa bahay yung body cream kasi malangkit siya. Pero pag nasa office ako, it's air conditioned. Um, Doon ko lang sila nagagamit. Tapos naamoy niya. And she was like, Ang bango, parang amoy pang romansa. So, bumili siya ng mist. So, yeah, um, whipped rose and vanilla. Kung gusto mo ng rose and vanilla na scent. If you want yung tipong floral, pero vanilla, pero sweet. Yeah, um, pwede naman siyang gamitin sa mainit na panahon if you like vanilla. Pero if you're the one na um, ayaw mo ng vanilla na scent, eh, baka hindi mo ito magustuhan. But... I would highly, highly recommend one of my all-time favorites, one of the best scents I have smelled from Bath and Body Works. Another one, all-time favorite, is this one, Fairy Tale. So one of my best fragrance, <laughs> one of the best fragrance in my collection. We have Fairy Tale. This is pomegranate nectar, fresh orange blossom, vanilla bean, and warm amber. Ang category nito para sa akin is a fruity, perfumey vanilla na type of fragrance. So. Hindi siya yung vanilla na gourmand na vanilla. Pero meron siyang vanilla in the dry down. Special in the dry down. Meron siyang pagka perfumey. I think it's from the amber. Pero hindi siya yung tipong amber na super synthetic. Like um, yung naamoy ko sa sensual amber and amber romance. I didn't like those two too much. Um, they are too synthetic to my nose. Although they're good. They're perfumey but they're too synthetic for my nose. Hindi siya ganun dito yung amber niya. And yung opening niya is that fruity pomegranate I think. Um... It's sweet, but it's perfumey. Na it can be um, polarizing, which means hindi siya magugustuhan ng lahat ng tao. Hindi siya para sa lahat, pero kung ikaw yung tipong gusto mo ng perfumey na scent, baka magustuhan mo si Fairy Tale. This is a dupe of the YSL Leave na tabango. And maraming dika gusto yun sa fragrance community, yung YSL Libre. Libre. Some people say Libre, some people say Lieb, but um, let's just call it Lieb. So, why is a Lieb is like an amber floral type of fragrance, I think. Um, I might be wrong. I'll put the notes here if I find it in Fragrantica. Pero, siguro hindi ko bibilhin yung um, perfume kasi meron ako nito. If I can get the vibe of... If I'm already okay with this one, why would I get a more expensive one? Although, I'm thinking of trying trying. I'm thinking of trying it because I might be missing out on something. Pero kasi ako yung tipong pag masyadong matagal yung pabango or masyadong malakas yung pabango na ginamit ko nauubo ako. So if this is already okay for me then this is already okay. One of my all time favorites if you can only listen to me with one fragrance in this video Ito yun. Pero, you have to like um, perfumey na type of body mists. Yung mga susunod na bangitin ko are more like runner-ups. Because, um, it's either they're too gas-gas na, masyadong marami nang nabanggit. But, kung bago ka nga sa Bath and Body Works, it's worth checking this out. So, we have Vanilla Confetti Sparkle. So, this is also a repackage. So, matagal na to kay... Bath and Body Works ni re-release lang nila. And this one is Creamy Cake Frosting, Rainbow Sprinkles, and Vanilla Bean. So, ito yung, um, di ba yung friend, yung, yung friend ko kanina na 
Uh, sinasabi ko na hindi nagustuhan tong wrapped in vanilla kahit gusto niya ng mga vanilla na scents. Nagustuhan niya to. Hindi niya to nagustuhan kasi nakulangan siya sa vanilla nito. Pero ito, gustong gusto niya kasi I, I smell this one a lot from her um, at work. So, this is creamy cake frosting, rainbow sprinkles, and vanilla beans. So, this is a cakey coconutty vanilla. So, ang naamoy ko sa kanya is a coconutty vanilla. So, you, you have to like coconutty scents and heavy vanilla scents para magustuhan mo si vanilla confetti sparkle. And, nagpro-project naman siya kasi at work, kapag gamit to ng ka-office mate ko, yung binentahan ko, <laughs> kapag gamit niya, naamoy ko siya. So, yeah. Vanilla confetti sparkle. You have to like coconut and vanilla to love vanilla confetti sparkle. Another super sweet scent, we have strawberry pound cake. So, meron siyang tape dito because I'm selling this one because I have a... Hindi ko alam bakit siya, siya binili. <laughs> meron na pala ako nung ano, nung... Hindi ko alam kung ito yung ibibenta ko or yung um, older packaging, yung rare packaging. Because I'm thinking like, um, meron ako mga rare packaging tapos um, nakatago lang naman sila. Kasi hindi ko kasi gusto yung dinidisplay because it destroys the fragrance, and I don't have space para i-display yung mga pabango. So, ang nakalagay, nakalagay lang sila sa ilalim ng table, ilalim ng bed. Anyway, that's beside the point. Strawberry Pound Cake is in the runner-ups because ang tagal na rin ito sa Bath and Body Works, and maraming beses na siyang nabanggit for um, a lot of chana channels. Channels? <laughs> a lot of channels. Kaya baka narinig mo na rin ko. So, kaya siya nandito sa runner-up. So, this is Strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. So, ito yung amoy mo na sa opening niya. Pero pag dry down, it's more like a cakey, strawberry cake, pound cake type of fragrance. Um, ito yung mga bake shop type of fragrance. Yung gusto mo ng matatamis na fragrance. Nagustuhan to ng sister ko and I gifted her one, yung faceted na packaging. Um, this is not the newest one. Ito yung lumabas yata last year. Pero meron na ulit na bagong pabango. Ang tabong pango. Bagong packaging. Si Strawberry Pound Cake. Paiba-iba ng packaging niya. So, it doesn't matter. I think pare-parehas lang naman yung amoy niya. Generally. Maybe may konting-konting hint na mga amoy ka. Kung masyadong maselan yung ilong mo. But, I think wala namang masyadong huge difference. Kasi it's the same name. It's the same company that's making it. So, let's move on to something perfumey. We have You're the One. So, kung bago ka lang sa Bath and Body Works, baka First time mo tong maamoy or ma marinig, you might have been sleeping under a rock. Pero kung hindi ka na bago sa Bath and Body Works, matagal na tong binabanggit sa lahat ng channel since, lahat ng gumagawa ng Bath and Body Works na channel, since lumabas siya, I think that was 2020. So this is White Birch, Velvety Rose, and a Drop of Strawberry Nectar. So this is a perfumey rose and strawberry in a scent. So it's a fruity rose scent, pero you have to like rose na perfuming a fragrance because this is strong this is the best most long lasting the fragrance that I gamit ko uh, from Bath and Body Works and actually in my entire life wala pa akong nagamit na pabango ng ganito ka long lasting compared sa you're the one aside from I think that was Baccarat Rouge I think I tried a decant of that and it was long lasting but I got levels nito and that was so surprising kasi um this is just a body mist, which um, I don't know what they placed in here to make it that long lasting. Bakit hindi nila ma replicate sa other na other fragrances, but this is well made for a body mist. Kung ikaw yung tipong isa lang yung gusto mo from Bath and Body Works, yung gusto mo yung pinaka long lasting and pinaka perfumey, it's gonna be this one. Para talagang bumili ka ng perfume, yung tipong ADP EDT. Minsan talo niya yung mga EDT, mga EDP na gamit ko. Kasi pag mga EDT, EDP ko, they're freshies. And this one is, it's not a freshie. <laughs> it has a little bit of freshness, but it's a um, heavy floral na fragrance. And this can be polarizing because not everyone will appreciate you're the one. Especially kung ayaw mo ng rose. Because rose can sometimes smell like, um, may matanda for some people, but for me, it is not. It smells elegant. And ito yung rason kung bakit nabuo yung channel ko around Bath and Body Works. This is the reason. Nagustuhan din to ni Chan, kasi nung dumating siya, nung pinagin ko siya sa decant no, nung nag-uumpisa ako last year, na mag-discover ng fragrance. 
and I was in a different room, tapos na amoy niya, and he complimented me. So I started looking into Bath and Body Works, and now we're making a channel around Bath and Body Works. I'm trying to expand my collection or my videos in the future, so if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comment section below kung anong gusto niyo makita sa aking channel aside from pabango contents. So anyway, um, dami ko nang nasabi sa you're the one. So, this is the one that started it all. But again, this is heavy. So, this huge disclaimer. Kung masyadong sensitive yung nose mo, baka hindi mo to magustuhan. I have sensitive nose, so hindi ko siya masyadong nagagamit. Ang nabawas din ay dinikant ko. Um, I only bring a decant kasi konti lang yung spray na kailangan ko. Kasi meron this one time na ginamit ko siya like how I use a regular body mist. Yung tipong... Do you get what I mean? Yung ang dami-dami yung mong ini-spray. Para, kasi nga, mist nga, cologne nga, di ba? So, ginamit ko siya one time na ganun sa office. And, hindi naman siya ganun kainit sa office kasi may aircon naman. Tapos, inubo ako. Mag maghapan akong inuubo. And, I know it's not because I have cough or colds. It's because I was wearing something heavy. Ganun kasi ako pag may pabango na masyadong too much for my nose. Nauubo ako. <laughs> so yeah, um, this is really strong. Siyempre, hindi natin kakalimutan si Gingham. So Gingham, nakabalot siya kasi I haven't opened it yet. Kasi ang dami ko nang inuubos. Um, ito yung ginagamit ko, uh, which is the EDP. Bukas na kasi ito, kaya mostly I am using this one for now. So this is a citrusy floral type of fragrance. This is Blue Freesia, White Peach. Fresh clementine, violet, and clean musk. So, it's a citrusy floral type of fragrance. I know maraming magkakagusto nito. Maraming nagkagusto nito kay Gingham. Ito yung parang nagre-represent kung ano si Bath and Body Works because of the packaging, yung Gingham. Iba yung mga walls ni Bath and Body Works, Gingham, tapos yung mga paper bag nila Gingham. So, yeah, this is an accurate representation yung mga prino promote ni Gingham na sense which is young but they're they're also catering to um, a little bit more grown up women kasi pwede siya sa younger people pwede rin siya sa um, older generation kasi meron akong ka-office mate na ginawa niyang signature fragrance niya to and she's already a mom and a little a little bit close to 40, I, I don't know her age, but um, ginawa niyang signature fragrance na gustuhan ng husband niya sa kanya, and ang bangon ito sa kanya, nag-proproject ito sa kanya, kahit yung body mist lang yung, gusto, ay, yung ginagamit niya, nag-proproject siya, pero pag sa akin, hindi siya long-lasting sa body chemistry ko, so that's what we always say with fragrances, iba-iba tayo ng body chemistry, so minsan may mga nag-work na pabango sa'yo, na hindi mag-work sa akin, may mga pabango na mag-work sa akin, tapos hindi mag-work sa'yo. So, take everything that I mentioned in this channel with a grain of salt because we have to consider body chemistry and preference natin sa pabango. So, ang mabango para sa akin, maring hindi mabango para sa'yo. Get what I mean? And the other way around. So, anyway, gingham. Kung hindi mo pa ito naaamoy, what are you doing? Go, smell it. Meron na tayong Bath and Body Works dito sa Pilipinas, sa Mega Mall. Although, nung pumunta kami doon last, um, I think that was last month, hindi siya well-stocked. I think kasi uh, naubos. Naubos yata nung pagka-launch nila. But you can visit them at Mega Mall, SM Mega Mall. I made a video of a store tour. I'll put it in the description box kung interested ka makita ko ano itsura ng store ng Bath and Body Works. Wala sila akong masyadong nakita ng mga ganito. I think meron akong nakita ng A Thousand Wishes. Mabango din yun. Um, but I'll let you, I'll let you see yung video I'll put in the description box below. If you're still here, thank you so much. Meron akong announcement. So, we are finally getting monetized after more than a year of creating videos. So, thank you, thank you so much sa inyong mga suporta, sa pagpanonood, pagkakomment, pagla-like sa aking mga videos. Salamat, salamat, salamat. So, nagbunga yung ating effort, yung pagpupuyat, yung yung lahat ng obsession ko sa pabango, lahat ng obsession ko sa pag 
mag-create ng videos. Kasi meron one time na na-obsessed ako ng how to create videos. Kahit hindi ko naman masyadong na, na, <laughs> na master how to vlog, but um, there was a time na lahat ng mga pinapanood ko on a daily basis is about um, yung mga gurus on sa mga YouTube gurus. YouTube gurus that teaches how to how to YouTube, how to be a YouTuber. Yun yung laging paulit-ulit na nag-play sa akin YouTube video while I'm working. Matagal ko nang naging pangarap na maging YouTuber. Since college, nung na-discover ko yung YouTube, the side of beauty YouTube, yung na, napapanood ko pa nun sila, sila Michelle Phan, sila Wayne Goss, sila yung mga napapanood ko, si Niga Higa, yung mga yun. <laughs> so, nung nakita ko sila, parang gusto kong gawin maging, ma, gawing mag-vlog din. But, it took time kasi wala akong equipment and I didn't know where to start. So, na, na, natangga lang siya as a uh, pangarap for the future. Tapos, um, I tried, pero ang pangit ng register ng mga camera ko noon. And, I think that was around 2018 or 2019 when I started recording myself. I was so awkward, hindi ko pa alam kung anong ginagawa ko. Pero bumili ako ng ring light. <laughs> Medyo napaka-yellow pa ng itsura ng mga older videos ko. And hindi ko pa alam paano magsalita in front of a camera. Because um, if you have tried vlogging, it's it's a little bit unnerving na nag nagsasalita ka mag-isa in front of camera. Tapos hindi mo alam kung saan ang magandang angulo. Hindi ko pa rin naman alam hanggang ngayon. But thank God na meron mga nanonood. So thank you very much guys for supporting me in this journey. So I'm hoping to expand my um, YouTube channel outside sa comfort zone ko na pabango. So if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comment section below. Kung nandito ka pa, I have a giveaway, a small giveaway. We have this one, Bubblegum Pop. Bakit bubblegum pop? Kasi ang dami kong stock nito and wala mo ibili sa akin. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, not a lot of people probably would like to smell like bubblegum but I am choosing this one because it's a unique scent sa Bath and Body Works. Um, wala pa akong naamoy na kaamoy niya. Wala pa akong naamoy na pabango na super bubblegummy aside from yung bubblegum scent ni Moschino and this one. So, it's not a scent na very overused in the fragrance community. And it's also safe kasi pwede siya for bata and pwede siya for medyo mas matanda. I think, in my own opinion. And safe din siya kung hindi mo siya magustuhan, pwede mo siyang gawing room freshener. Kasi meron akong kaibigan na she likes a lot of sweet scents but when I suggested bubblegum scent, she was like, uh, no. She doesn't want, want to wear it, but she would like to use it as a room spray. So, yeah, those are the options. Kaya, bubblegum pop. And besides, um, parang naparami akong binili noon <laughs> nung lumabas si bubblegum pop. And look at the packaging. It's it's so cute. Isn't it? So, anyway, gumball sugar, candied fruits, and citrus burst. So, may pagka-citrus siya sa opening. So, it's a fresh scent, versatile scent. Pwede siya sa initan dito sa Pilipinas. So, enough with this one. Um, this is what I chose. So, wala kayong magagawa. <laughs> wala kayong magagawa. <laughs> so, ito yung papag-giveaway natin. So, simple lang naman yung mechanics. Lagi na aking giveaway. So, you have to be, make sure to subscribe. You have to be, make sure, ano? <laughs> make sure you are subscribed. Like this video and comment below kung ano yung mga um, other video topics na gusto mong makita sa aking video. I'm not gonna promise na pagbibigyan ko kayo lahat kasi mag-isa lang naman ako and I have a full-time job and I'm also studying so dami-dami kong ginagawa but I will try to um, do my best para pagbigyan yung kaya kong gawin. So any suggestion, I will appreciate that. Put in the comment section below and at the end, lagyan nyo ng hashtag Mia Kim Fragrance para alam ko na nag-join ka sa giveaway. So I will announce the giveaway winner um, in this date or I'll put in the description description box kung kailan ko siya i-announce. And, yeah, I will post it sa community or in Facebook. So, follow me follow me on my Facebook page then if you haven't yet. So, yeah. Anyway, thank you so much and if you want more fragrance-related contents, I'll see you on this next video. Bye!